Welcome to Durbania. I'm Durbin. I'm Laura. So, earlier, I did my Split review, and Laura, while I was watching Split, she went to see Triple X. So if yes. you want to see my spoiler-free review for Split, click the link, and you can check that out. Right now, Laura, you saw Triple X. I, I didn't. So I did. this is all your review. Okay, well, first off, um, I'm going to start by saying I feel like this was uh, better than the other two. If you've seen the Triple X movies and you like them, you're definitely going to like this movie. Um, if you didn't like them before because you thought they were hokey and cheesy and unrealistic, well, guess what? You're going to get hokey, cheesy, and unrealistic in this one too. So they're they're not invent reinventing the wheel or anything with this one. But um, I will say I enjoyed it. I mean, I had a good... Well, I enjoyed it, but I never want to see it again. I'm good. I've seen it <laughs> once. So it's like, because I really went in with very, very low expectations because I was not a huge fan of the movies because of the cheesy and the hokey. And and it's like, I, I like things to be a little grounded because a lot of that stuff is unrealistic. Like, you know, that whole opening sequence uh, in the trailer where he's like oh, yeah, sliding he's down, down. And, yeah. and he hits it. He's, then he's on his skateboard and that... You could so see it's a body double, like, the entire time. <laughs> oh, man. And it's, like, the only time you see Vin Diesel's face is, like, when he's slowed down talking, like, going down for a second. It's just, like, one of those shots. So that was, you know, but I will say, early on, you get a Donnie Yen fight sequence. Nice. That, I love Donnie Yen. Donnie Yen. It, man. Is, oh. he's, he is so fast, and it is just so good, and... You can tell he's just having fun. Nice. And it's just, and it's like, if you like Donnie Yen, there are two great fight sequences with him in this movie and totally worth it for those. Because Is it I, worth I'm me a, going to the theater just no, for those? Okay. No. I would say if it was on Netflix or somewhere you could get it for free, I would fast forward to the fight scenes. <laughs> That's what how you would like it because this is not a movie that is in, okay. not, not one of his wheelhouse type movies. Oh, all right. Um, overall, I mean, the story was fun. I had a good time with it, um, which really surprised me, which is why it didn't get like a D or an F in my grading. Um, <laughs> so, because I was expecting it to be a D movie and I got a little better than that. So that's always nice. So there was like a different a different cast, more than just Vin Diesel, which I is common. And so the people that came in, his supporting actors, they were they were pretty enjoyable. Like the girl that you see that is um she's the girl with the like green hair. But I liked her. I thought she was a great supporting character. And also there's a character you don't see in the trailer, um, who um is like their IT girl. That's not like a spoiler, but she's funny. She has like just funny lines where it's not even she just like rambles or this happens and you just kind of go <laughs> that's good and there were a couple one-liners in the movie that made me laugh with uh, Samuel L. Jackson they just they, they had this uh crossover feel and I just kind of went like five minutes into the movie I'm like <laughs> that's a good one <laughs> so with all that said uh the only negatives hokey cheesy terrible dialogue Kind of like what you expect. Uh, some of the throwbacks that they did, like, hmm, the things I do for my country. I'm sorry, unrealistic. But <laughs> it, with all that said, I give this movie a C minus. Okay. Which is way better than I gave the other two. All right. <laughs> so that's just, I had a good time. It was better than I expected. I don't need to see it again. If I go back and think about it, it's not worth more than so that. So you don't want to think about it because you just want to savor the little bit of experience you had. I just want to savor the Donnie Yen fights. I there mean, that, that's the only reason the movie went from probably to a C minus. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta be real with you. I like violence. Well, there you have it. <laughs> that is Laura's thoughts. She loves senseless violence. I do. Laura's thoughts on the new Triple X movie. What did you think of it? Let us know in the comments. If you want to check out my spoiler-free review for Split, you can check that out here as well. I went and saw that while she's seeing Triple X. And tomorrow, for Saturday, I'm doing my spoiler talk for uh, Split. And I can't wait to get into that. Oh, I can't wait. You I can't wait. I want to spoil it. I haven't it. seen it yet. I won't. So. Okay. Anyway, so hit that subscribe button and become a Durbanian and get notified when the latest videos drop. I'm Durbin. I'm Laura. Thank you for checking out Durbania.